COVID sucks. He accidentally drank my drink. Ugh, I don't know why, but I feel like it's moving because I'm so sick of being inside. And I really think that has helped the COVID not be as bad. Good morning. So as you can tell by the title, I have the big C. This is my first time having it ever. I went two long, excruciating years without having the big C, but here we are. This guy has it too. I need to weigh myself. Let's go weigh myself. I'm still 154. I lost 0.7 more pounds. Yesterday I lost like a, a pound and a half. Well, we are sick. Keep it coming. Mm -hmm. Get this fat off me. That's how it sounds. <laughs> most of the time in this apartment. Just for like a quick explanation, Chase and I went on a cruise. Immediately when we got off the cruise, Chase started feeling bad. He accidentally drank my drink and then I drank it. When we found out that he tested positive, I felt fine for like a long time. We actually had a roommate here and everything, our old roommate here and everything and we were having fun. The next day I woke up with like an itty, itty bitty sore throat. And I felt like I had to cough, but I didn't need to. It was weird. And I told him he needed to leave. And then I started feeling it. That's where we are now. It's, how long has it been? It's been a week of us chilling. Right now we're gonna go for a walk because we went on a walk yesterday and it literally was the best thing that I have done since being in quarantine. I'm gonna try to enjoy our, our COVID day. Cause I'm so sick of being outside. So exhausted. We only walked one lap, which is, we usually walk at least two. Oh, but it was still nice to get out a little bit and kind of just look around instead of looking at a screen. Cause that's all I've been doing. But I edited a vlog yesterday. Literally have not been editing at all. I've just been sitting around because I just have not been in the mood. This is me. This is a good spot. <laughs> Accomplishment number two of the day. We took a shower. I also look fabulous, so we could put in a number three if we wanted to. It's crazy how such basic tasks are so much harder when your body is physically ill. I've been running a fever the last three days, I think. My symptoms haven't been nearly as bad as others. Chase was really out of it when he was like hit the hardest, but I'm still able to like get around. I don't feel amazing right now and it's harder to do things. I get tired faster, but besides that and just like the snot, not stopping, I'm fine. Started this little cold remedy immediately when I started feeling symptoms, and I really think that has helped the COVID not be as bad. Chicken nuggies. Let's do this. I ate my chicken nuggies and they were really yummy. <laughs> it's 2.16 and I feel like I've done nothing today and I wanna take a nap. <laughs> you guys wanna see my COVID setup? Here is my half of the couch. This half is Chase's. 
we share. We have a really fuzzy blanket that I have sneezed over a lot. We are gonna wash that once I feel better. We have my computer here with the necessities to edit. Also have my switch. And then if you move to our left, you can see this pillow. This is what it actually is supposed to look like. It's a decor pillow, but we are using it to lay my face on. This side is very comfortable. Before I caught COVID, I was sleeping on the couch because Chase had it. That was the pillow that I was using. But now that I know I have it, we can finally sleep together once again. We also have my phone. I got my phone case from Walmart, so I've been scrolling on TikTok a lot. We have my hairbrush because I just brushed my hair. We also have remote controllers. Here is our TV. It has helped a lot. I've watched all four seasons of Stranger Things on this in the past four days. Then we have a tissue box. Chase thankfully got this for me because my nosy was hurting and this has lotion in it. We also have a trash can right under our coffee table for easy accessibility to throw away said tissues. What are we going to do now, you may ask? Well, we're going to lay here for the next, what time is it? 2.21, the next eight hours until bedtime. I say we watch a movie, but he's busy. So maybe I'll just get on my phone. Is this focusing on me? Okay. Wow, my house is just a disaster. Everywhere I walk, I'm just leaving doors and things open. I have an idea. Let's show you guys the COVID OOTD because isn't that what really matters in life? We have these airy sweatpants. I've had these since middle school. The length fit me, they're low rise, which is trendy, guys. You have to stay on trend. Then we have this Grant Cardone, whatever it takes, shirt that I got. Says no whining, no bitching, no excuses on the back, which is just everything. Does this outfit match? Absolutely not, but it is comfortable and it gets the job done. I haven't seen any birdies out, so I think I'm going to put more bird feeder in there because I'm pretty sure they ran out. It's completely gone. This was completely full like a few days ago. kind of full, but we could refill it. All right, so I cleaned up a little bit out here. I just, as you saw, wiped that down and I swept. And I also got all the bird poop off. So I think the next thing that I'm gonna try and do is decorate out here. Because I honestly kind of want to get rid of this and get something a little cuter and just make this place look really nice and like come out here to relax and like read a book or something. Sounds so nice. So that's kind of like the next project I feel. Besides my side of the bedroom, I still haven't decorated that yet, but I need to and I will. I found this on the ground. Like, looks like a seashell. But it's like hollow, but there's like a little something inside. Ugh, I don't know why, but I feel like it's moving. I'm gonna toss it over. That was creepy. I don't know. Why would that be up here? It's weird, and now I feel like I need to wash my hands. So, we're gonna do that. We have our first customer. Hello, little friend. Are you enjoying the new feed? Why do I sound creepy? Usually they come to this one first and then they realize that the other one's there. Hello guys, it is 5.24. 5.24, I am editing TikToks that I filmed quite a while ago, to be honest. I've just been storing them and I really been needing to edit them, so I'm doing that. I also found a whole nother vlog that I filmed like before I went on my cruise and now I'm filming this, which is after my cruise. So I have like three videos that I need to edit and get up. Those are all vlogs, so that doesn't include main channel videos, which I feel like is why a lot of my subscribers are following me. So I kind of need to figure out a main channel video that I can upload in between those, preferably two. <laughs> 
but that might not happen because I also just posted a vlog. I need to worry more about my main channel videos, but it's just like so much more to edit and so much more planning. Vlogging so easy and fun. Gotta give the people what they want, which is body type. Social media is stressful. It really is. People are like dedicated when they do. They work so hard. <coughs> Look who came back with food. Thank you, bye. This is a beautiful taco. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it's been a bit later. Chase and I just went for a walk and there was like really crazy heat lightning. Honestly, it looked like something from Stranger Things and I felt like I was in the show and it was pretty awesome. But now we're just inside relaxing so i wanted to come on here and end the vlog so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed having covid with me and relaxing i was gonna do laundry because i have laundry that i need to fold but i didn't i guess i'll do that tomorrow but thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one bye